Pai, I am uh, uh, Francesco Samani and uh, I work in the university uh, like PhD student and uh, my tutor professor is uh, Marco Ceccarelli and uh, he he is uh, helping uh, me a lot to in the study and the, uh, in the research of uh, robotic and in particular in uh, robotic finger under actuated mechanism and uh, in the in the another part of the research is uh, fo focused in the um, service space robot in particular in uh, this video I want to talk about service space robot in the research in LARM2 that is a laboratory of uh, robot mechatronics in the University of Rome Tor Vergata in Italy. I am um, design, designing a prototype uh, of a service space robot. The name of this service space robot is Torve Astro and uh, uh, the it is designed and built for testing activity why to check the soundness of the robot design and to characterize its performance perform or to characterize Perform performance and to uh, to have a proper design. Uh, in uh, the study, a CAD model is used and is built using a 3D printer and uh, um, in particular is uh, it is used the PLA that is a particular material used in 3D print it is important uh, an introduction in this first video uh, because it is important to focus and to have an idea about space robotics. In, in particular space robotics is considered one of the most promising approaches for were on orbit servicing missions. It is important to, to say that because the development of space technology It is possible to have more co 
complex space tasks Però, the complexity of space task is growing up ok more complex space tasks in particular I think I suppose that in the future will be a develop of typical robots robots used in space for medical care or for space exploration the mining operation surveillance entertainment museum museum guide according to the international federation of robotics IFR International Federation of Robotics it is possible to describe a service robot that is a robot which operates semi or fully autonomously to perform services useful to the well-being well of human and equipment excluding manufacturing operation okay i can write the most important things allora, the well uh, semi or fully Auto no mostly to perform service services. Um, it is important to say a part uh, a thing, and this thing is that. I am sorry for my English. I know that my English is not perfect and I, I am very sorry for this reason. I hope that my English it is uh, easy and easier to understand. And for this reason, I, I am speaking very slow. But for me, it is important to share the knowledge about the robotic and in this video, in particular, about server space robot, in particular, in the study of a new of a novel cable driven astronaut robot and in the study a lot of test activity has been done and a prototype has been built a CAD model has been designed and now with the first prototype with the, the use the test the simulation the experiment experimental validation of the prototype of Torbe Astro it is possible 
to have an idea about this service space robot that is has a circular geometry and has three arm legs and every arm legs has three degree of freedom. The end factor is put obviously in the last link and this is a configuration, a CAD model of about the design of Torbe Astro. The study is uh, and the research is uh, I am um, doing a lot of research and uh, I am lucky because I have a team and in particular a professor that is very able he, that uh, my professor has a lot of capacity of uh, ability in uh, all things that are about robotic mechanical mechatronic robotic and I want to share with you my studies for uh, this first video I think that uh, is uh, um, is better to finish now uh, because uh, I want to see uh, if uh, you are interested in the this type of research and if yes you can to push the like button to subscribe in the YouTube channel and to write comments about this video uh, I am uh, I want to say thank you for all and uh, I will wait your comments thank you very much with regard Francesco Francisco <laughs> Francesco Samani in Italian uh, Francisco Samani in English. Bye bye, see you soon.